use a noise to describe how excited you are for Christmas. <coughs> I find Santa weird and unappealing. Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's a girl Evile. You already know the vibes already, and that's on period. Welcome to Vlogmas Day One. <laughs> so yeah, I came up with this random idea to do like a vlog, start my vlogmas. I know today is the 8th of December. It's kind of somehow late per se, cause like everybody, I recited November period and I was having exams. I just say, okay, let me just start from now and see where this gets us. I'm not sure if I might keep up with this, but you know, yeah, stay tuned to find out. And make sure you press that subscribe button right under this video. So yeah, let's get right into the video. So I'm going to be answering a couple of questions. Like the first today's content is going to be answering questions listening to Christmas, like possible questions that I could get asked. I'm answering them. And I'm also like, yeah, just you know, answering like a question, a Christmas question tag. That's my vlogmas day one. Yeah, let's get right to it. <gasps> so excited. And also I also wore like red. I don't know. Random, did you know that this is just a coincidence that I had this this shirt like i i got it since like a few months ago and i'm more it's literally like supposed to be a nicer person but i don't know that's it god just knew that okay i'm going to need this one day and now yeah it's like giving christmas vibes i'm so worried to represent christmas it's actually a nice but you know you know we actually need. so the first question i have here is use a noise to describe how excited you are for christmas bruh my edge is nice to use so skip to the second question so question two says what is the best present you've ever received for christmas well the best present i've ever received for christmas is actually i think it's a long time ago sha um i can't really remember the time i think it was around that when i was a child i think it was um i think it was a dress yeah i think i think i got a dress for christmas and i was like really really happy <coughs> that time because the dress was so pretty I think it's a dress, if I can remember, I think it's a dress because, yeah, it should be a dress I think that was when I was 8 or 9 years that I got it so yeah, a dress next question the next one says, what is the worst present you've ever received for Christmas? I think the worst present I've ever received is not really <coughs> like a present present, it's just like a fight, like it was I think it was last Christmas or social like, because um we go to church on christmas day to celebrate like christmas we do we have like a church mass in christmas so it was my mom and my sister they were fighting like on our way there we just said a random fight and they like, like the fight was so petty but it got so serious at the point like it was very very petty and i was not in the middle like i was angry because i wanted to that day i wanted to vlog and they were not fighting and then when i came back from church she that day because we don't normally go out on christmas day because christmas day is always crowded like everywhere is always crowded so we normally like to go out the next day to celebrate it so <clears throat> i told we just stay at home eat enjoy ourselves be together and all that so um like i came back home that day everybody nobody was talking to each other like it was so frustrating i was now like pressing my phone i was not seeing how families are celebrating christmas how everybody's going out and taking pictures and everything like at the point even 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 shamida said because shamida was shy getting disgusting to me i just had to off my phone and sleep i had a nap i woke up i said that the day is not over what was going on i shot on tv i was watching and i'm gonna be not this christmas special movies i was like can this just end like can you just end i'm tired Shasha, the next day i i ended up getting to enjoy it because the next day they resolved their issues and we went out celebrate lunch and we ate you know the vibes yeah that was it okay next one says as a kid did a sibling ever receive a present that you wish was for you um well yeah but like it wasn't christmas that the thing happened like i'm the last born so i'm like bound to receive like lower amount of gifts than my sister because i think when i was small yeah but now they don't really do that again just give us equal things but like when i was small they like to like give her like more like people that come over as far guests will give her more and they do just give me like the lesser part because they feel i'm the junior one so at first i was like i don't understand the, why the whole reason for it because i was like i don't guess why is why are they acting what's the need for it but later on as i grew up i realized that that's actually how it's supposed to be and there's not two ways about it so yeah 
So the third question says, what presents would, what present would I like to receive for Christmas this year? Well, the present I would like for Christmas this year is a new phone. Bruh. Uh-huh. That's the present I would like. Um, not the present that I would get. I'm just saying, like, a new phone would be really something that I really want for Christmas and enjoy myself and, you know, all that. Like, I think, yeah, a new phone is something that I, I really want for Christmas as on my, like, wish list because i created a wish list some time ago i think it was it was around that october period i created a wish list and yeah i was like that's my wish list for my birthday a lot of people thinking it was my birthday that was next year but it was actually for christmas that i like really want really love to get for christmas shop next question says when was the last time you had the christmas tree put up in your house the last time i had the christmas tree put up in my house was 2018 christmas that time ah, God, I was so happy for Christmas. Like, Christmas was a vibe to me. I was so calm. That time I was in just one. I wanted to decorate everywhere. I literally bought Christmas lights. When they saw the things on my estate, I bought Christmas lights. I bought Christmas decorations. I bought, like, we really had the Christmas tree. I bought Christmas balls. I literally brought two Christmas lights. I put, I, I like, made one an extension around the ceiling. So you like, went round the four walls of the house. And then I used the other one to, you know, go around the christmas tree and on it and light it and that time i did not have a phone if i had the phone i'd have taken pictures of it like it was so pretty like that time was so small but i had a really huge sense of decorating like honestly that was the last time that i had the christmas tree the christmas tree i didn't i think forgot something happened to it i think the thing got spoiled i think the thing got yeah like i think the thing got misplaced and that's and since then we've not bought a new one so i just you know vibing next one says sing a line from your favorites Christmas song. <clears throat> ah, R.I.P. to headphone users. On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me. Mm. I can't sing. That's on period. Yeah. Next one says, "What's your favorite thing about Christmas?" Well, my favorite thing about Christmas is the part where we dress up. The part where we have fun. I would have said the Christmas tree, but what happened to the Christmas tree, Omo? <sighs> That's what I have to say. The part where we drink, the part where we have fun, the part where we eat a lot of food. Do my no, no, no. the favorite thing is the food that they used to cook in the house when it's Christmas period. We call it Christmas special food. They will cook it, they will not garnish it, they will not make everything so be saucy. They will be eating. Christmas time we'll be eating. And also my other favorite thing about Christmas is the fact that we all go out um, um like um occasional intervals and have fun and be as a family <clears throat> and that's the only part that my mom does not used to shout like that that much and we can actually we can literally do anything to annoy her and then she'll just be like let me just ignore cause it's Christmas, you know, and then we'll be annoying her, she'll be ignoring. But after Christmas, um, anyways, yeah, that's my favorite thing about Christmas. <clears throat> Next one says, when is I get excited for Christmas? Well, I say get excited for Christmas towards that. Like when I start, when I start seeing decorations around, like now you go to all these malls, like places like restaurants, mega chic, none of them. You just see like decorations, or like in the night, like they normally use Christmas lights. Some people they don't use Christmas tree. Some malls, like the mall beside my house, they use Chris <coughs> Christmas tree. So Christmas tree, even in the daytime, you'll be able to see it. I love places that they use like lights, like Christmas lights, because in the night, ah, oh, God, it's just so shining, it's be really beautiful. In the daytime, the whole fit is, which I said, is not in there, but then in the night, it's be very beautiful. I think, I think that's, that's like my favorite thing. That's when I start getting excited for Christmas, particularly. Next one says, share a funny Christmas memory. <clears throat> a funny Christmas memory, I think it was 2016 Christmas period when we all went out like what what even happened yes it was me and my neighbors kids that went and my mom took us all of us out we went to this um <clears throat> garden this park i think that time i was around i think seven or so we went to this garden we had fun and we hopped on a horse that was the fun oh god like we had the horse ride that horse ride was not like <clears throat> i don't know like that in the memory like i can still remember the horse ride your shred was so typical, like, like they were hitting the things for the things to go fast, and it, it started going very, very fast. <coughs> it started going <coughs> extremely fast, more. 
it now hits like the thing was going extremely fast i was very very afraid like i was extremely afraid then from there i don't even know what happened i think i can't remember i think we i thought i, I thought i was going to fall down so then i said i was not in the at the point i was like they should i was just like, they stop they stop they should stop that they should all stop that i'm going to fall down very soon <laughs> but i don't know sure i think yeah i think that was what happened because i can't really remember but my child my funniest memory is when we went on the horse ride the horse ride was i think that was the last time i went on the horse ride I, after that i was like oh i know they do it again i'm not doing it again literally pictures with santa here only if yes share a fave now I find Santa weird and unappealing. Bruh. And the final question here says, rule of fake, rule of fake Christmas tree. Anyone actually, anyone, as long as it's, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. But to me, I don't care about the quality. As long as the intention behind it is just love and care and happiness and the spirit of Christmas. Like I literally do not care about, about like I literally don't care about the quality. Anyone actually. As long as it's it comes with love, it comes with care, it comes with understanding, anyone would do for me. So yeah, that's my opinion concerning Disha. Yeah. So we have concluded this day one of Vlogmas and we have concluded our question tag. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to like, don't forget to comment and don't forget to subscribe and enjoy. I just hope you enjoy and leave your comments, leave your feedback in the comments below. Tell me what you found faulty, tell me what you found, be honest, you know, communicate well and you know, I'll take, I'll take your comments into consideration. And yeah, we've completed this day one and it was a successful one. Yeah, that was on period. When I first came on camera, I was like, let me just do a vlog mask. Because I was simply putting vlog on, like, let me just do my own. Like, I didn't know have, I didn't have complete confident feelings about it like i was like i don't know if it will go well or if i'll be consistent enough and i still don't know if i'll be consistent enough but i'm just trying my best like any any events anything that comes up i'll make sure i vlog it and add it to the vlogmas um vlogmas season so yeah please this is episode one concluded Woo! produced by me produced by me produced by me and the producer the amazing producer and that's on period so yeah please forget don't forget to like subscribe and enjoy yourselves i just hope you enjoyed watching so far god bless you all and bye i love you i love you